Today, we are finally starting Celestial Island on my singing monsters. You guys did not tell me how difficult this island was going to be. This monster right here. I literally bred 20 pot bellies. And then this monster here. Yeah, yes, guys. I prepared a lot of this off camera. 25 tweedles. That is way too... That, no one should ever have to breed that many tweedles. Nevertheless, guys, here we are. We have two monsters. We're going to be getting them both unlocked in this video. Hey, guys, I think we're just going to go ahead and start with this monster right here. I can't remember. Blasume. I, I think that's his name. Let's go ahead and see what we have to get unlocked here. Okay, so we need four thumpies and three pummels, and that's literally it. So we should be able to literally just blow through this right now. Cool, guys. I am excited that we finally have another island in the process of getting worked. You guys know I like to take my time with the island. So let's go ahead and work on getting this monster. The thumpies are here, so we should be able to get these guys bred pretty quickly. Let's go ahead and throw one of our 15 coursters in with our thumpies, and we should just be able to get them right off the bat, and there we go. We only need four more, and I already forgot the other monster. Let me go ahead and check. Okay, pummel. Pummel, pummel, pummel. Don't let me forget that, guys. Let's go ahead and zap him over. And with them being sent, we only need three more thumpies here. So we should be able to roll through this super, super fast. I know a lot of you guys have been looking forward to Celestial Island. I've been hearing a lot of comments hyping the island up and saying how cool it is. And dude, as much work as I'm putting in getting these breeds, this island better be cool. This better be worth it. I'm telling you, I'm going to be so upset. This should be our last thumpy right here. And then we should be able to move on over to Pummel. Let me, I, I might've actually bred an extra one. No, okay, we're good. This is the last one. So let's go ahead and zap him over to Zach. There we go. Okay, is Pummel here? I actually don't know. Pummel is... Pummel is not here. Okay, I believe we can find Pummel on Air Island, though. So if we go here, is he here? No, he's not. Wow, I'm literally the worst YouTuber ever, guys. We're gonna ignore that and pretend it didn't happen. I know he's over here on our plant island. Let's see. Uh, okay, top left. There he is. And I think we need three of him, right? Dude, I'm telling you, whenever I'm recording, my memory is so bad. I'm just trying to focus on talking and getting these things done. And I can just, I can literally, I bred a boger. Why did I just breed a boger? Okay, see, I, I literally told you. I can't process what I'm doing, bro. Okay, let's throw Imp right in with Pummel. I don't know what I just did to get that boger bred, but here we go. We have Pummel moving in progress now and let's go back to the celestial tab and let me just check okay we need three so perfect we're literally 33 percent done right now we need two more pummels and then we'll be able to awaken this first monster and start our celestial i bred it in I bred a ghast? What? <laughs> bro, I just accidentally bred gas. Okay, wait. We've got to place gas down. How did that... Bro, what a plot twist. Gas is so hard to breed, and we somehow just got that. Okay, I'm just going to leave her down there for now. And now let's go back to trying to get this pummel. What a plot twist in the video. All right, guys. With this pummel bred, I believe we only need two, this guy and then one more. So we're almost done. And then we're going to be able to hear the opening for our new island song. There's no way I just bred another gas. There's no way. What? What? Yo, how am I just breeding ghasts right now? Bro, what? That's crazy, dude. Okay, let's just place her down here. There's got to be a sale going on. Like, there's no way I'm just breeding them this fast. I, I don't know, guys. I'll take it, though. I'm not complaining. I already know there's someone that's been trying to get ghasts forever, and I just accidentally got two of them without even trying, and I know you're so mad. I'm sorry. All right, guys, let's finalize our first Celestial Island monster right now. Your Celestial is ready to be revived. Would you like to go? Yes start take me there here we go guys our monster zaxu i believe his name is is ready to be revived this is different i've never revived a monster so let's see what happens here yo what a cool animation guys i love those kind of animations like when you awaken a wobbling and now we have a new one for celestial island all right guys let's let's just go through this here and hear what this monster sounds like okay we have like a horn sound oh it's like oh it's going like up and down there then it reset. <laughs> Fire, guys. Okay, cool. I always love trumpety kind of horn sounds like that. So I think that's a cool monster to kind of start our vibe off here for our Celestial Island. And now that I think about it, guys, I don't think there's actually that many monsters. Yeah, this is... Well, actually, that's kind of a lot. And I'm guessing as we just go, it's going to be harder and harder to get every one of these guys. Oh, this is going to be a painful series. I need you guys to go ahead and subscribe so you can just see me get tortured getting all of these monsters. All right, guys, our next guy in line is going to be Atomos. And I did a lot of work for him as well, but we do have a few more monsters.
monsters to breed. So we have one Reedling, one Riff, and then we have two Sponges and two Thumpies. And then this guy is going to be ready to be awoken, and we're going to have our second monster for Celestial Island. This is exciting stuff, guys. Okay, I think we're going to go ahead and focus on getting the two Sponges. Let's go to Water Island for that. I love Octopus being in the intro. All right, guys, we're going to focus on getting Sponge here. So we're going to be throwing our four element shell bead in with Sponge, and we should just be able to roll through getting these first two. And it looks like we actually have a slower counter right now. Wait, I can zap? Wait a minute, what does this mean? Rare flex? Wait, what? This is, I can zap. Okay, what does that mean, guys? It's giving me an option to zap back to the celestial monster that I just awoken. Okay, I don't know what that means, guys. Y'all gonna have to let me know down in the comment section below. We're just gonna forget that for now, and let's keep working on this guy right here. I'm alright now. Go with the flow. This is our final sponge, guys. We're gonna go ahead and zap him over and then work on the thumpies next. See you later, sponge. All right, and now I'm sorry, Water Island. We gotta peace out. Let's go over to Earth Island and get our thumpies here. Do, 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 do. Just keep your feet on the ground and move your head all around. Sorry, right, guys. We can't get distracted, bro. I can never come to these good islands because they always just take me off course and I forget what we're supposed to be doing. But here we are. We got our last set of thumpies here. I believe we only needed two. Yeah, okay, so he's done. And now we're gonna need to get Riff and Reedlet. Cool, noted. Got it. Bada bing, bada boom. Okay, now we're gonna go over to Air Island to get our homeboy Riff here. And we're actually gonna have to breed him from scratch because I don't have a rare version of him here. So we're gonna have to do the old-fashioned way of breeding Riff, which you guys know what that means. How to breed Riff. Okay, it is best obtained by breeding T-Rox and Tweedle. Got it. Thank you very much, Google. Let me go ahead and light these torches. Thank you guys on the screen right now for lighting these for me. You guys are the absolute goats. Now we're going to be throwing T-Rox in with our homegirl down here, Tweedle. Here we go, guys. I don't know how long this is going to take, but luck might be on our side today because we somehow bred two gas without even trying. So maybe we're going to get lucky. Let's go, guys. That's awesome. Okay, I think we only needed one, right? Yes, we only needed one. Okay, perfect. Perfect. So now we literally just need to get a Reedling bread, and then we're going to be good to go. And I don't think Reedling's here. No, he's not. So we're going to have to go over somewhere else. Let's go to, like, Firehaven. Let's get some different vibes rolling here. Got who got you. Bro, I love that when you get on this island, you just instantly hear Floa. Who got you. All right, guys, let's get this last Reedling bread, and then we're going to open up our second monster for... Sorry, not open. Uh, what is it? What's the term that they like to use? Awaken. Yes, we're going to be awakening our second guy for Celestial Island right here and now. Let's zap him on over. Skadoosh. Yes, sir. Oh, not awaken. Revived. I was thinking about Wobbling Island, I'm pretty sure. But here we are, guys. We're back here. Adamos, he is fully open now. Let's go ahead and get him revived. Let me see the animation. Yo, dude. Whoa, he looks a lot different than what I thought he looked like. He looks like way shorter. Okay, let's go ahead and hear what he sounds like. Oh. Yo, what just happened? Bro, I was about to react to my monster and then I got beasted. My singing monster was like, nope, you're not watching that. I saw him like play a guitar sound though, but like he doesn't have a guitar. That sounded sick though, whatever the heck he did. There he is coming back in. Okay, he has like an invisible... Oh, and he's singing. Oh, he's giving us a vocal. Oh, dude, that electric guitar is just like ringing out. Wait, now that I think about it, I think I might have gotten a version of this monster on Dawn of Fire. He did not look like this, though. But I think they had similar sounds. And there he is kicking back in here. Yeah, he's just playing an invisible guitar, I guess. I know I'm definitely hearing that. And his voice has like a tinty kind of like DJ mesh. It's hard to explain. There's some kind of tint in there. You hear like growl almost in his voice. <laughs> Let's go, dude. Cool, guys. Okay, we have an opening here for the island. We finally have gotten things moving. A lot of you guys have been wanting me to start the island, so I hope this is going to be the start to another long series for the channel. Guys, I just started a new channel, and it's devoted to me just talking about my love for Jesus and just kind of talking about a bunch of different messages from the Bible. So I don't know if you guys are religious or if you aren't religious, but you're kind of curious about Jesus and you just want to kind of get to know him and what that kind of means for you. And guys, I would love for you to go check that channel out. I have two videos from the channel that are on the screen right now.